Watch out for Rokar and Garen fanatics that hate aliens. That means you. Hey, what's up, everybody? My name is TrophyNet, and welcome back to Mass Effect Andromeda. We're still on Havarl, and apparently the Rokar are closer than I expected. Um, I just placed another outpost here, and it seems like there's enemies close by. Although I don't really see them at the moment. Where are they? Ah, there they are. Rokar Saboteur, Rokar Raider. So those guys, I need to go through those guys. So sadly, sadly my, my dear man or woman I can see from here. We're gonna get a shot in the face. Let's activate Remy. Oh shit! There we go. Goodbye. And I think that's it. He kind of got electrified. I wonder why that happens. Or maybe that's because of my perks. Um, that that just started to happen. I need to go through these guys. Because, well, A, they're in front of a, of a remnant pillar. So that's something to look out for. And B, well, our next objective is over there. If I want to reach that, I'm going to have to go through these Rokar. Even if Jal doesn't really like what I'm doing at the moment, because I'm practically killing his people. What the hell is that? Oh, those are those remnant spiders. There's stuff happening. Don't know what's happening, but... Stuff is happening. People are shooting, and I don't see a single enemy. Okay, if you discover get any the monolith. Slime on your skin, I suggest you wash it off immediately. Let's be careful around the native flora, okay, everyone? Weird, glowy mushrooms. My day is complete. Okay, so. There we go, that's one observer down. There we go. There we go. And there's the last assembler. Yeah, that'll definitely show him. Um, so there's more ammo over here, which is good, because I need that. Ammo is in short supply since I'm using a sniper rifle. Don't really lost much health. But I'm going to start looting the place. And check out the... Probably, okay, that's good. Where are the thingies? The symbols I need to scan. Or am I not close enough for that yet? Let's go a bit deeper. Because this seems to go further than I expected it to go. Okay. Is this... This is just a monolith, right? This is not a complete... Gara. Vault. What's wrong with them? They're not moving. It's like they're in some kind of trance. Vital signs seem imply a relaxed state, much like sleep. Brainwave activity and metabolism are greatly slowed, but have not ceased entirely. Okay. That is weird. So, I would think... Don't touch the console, but... Let's try it anyway. Okay, so I'm missing glyphs, obviously. Scanning. We'll reveal the missing glyphs. Um. Ah, there's one. Is that the one? Nope, there's another glyph. That should do it. Okay. 
So let's try and open it, because this guy clearly tried to open it as well, because he's in the animation. Here we go. There we go. Succeeded. That was a pretty easy one. So there we Reading go. Reading of the monitors and... Scat. Scatting stars. What? Who are you? How um, I'm Ryder, and we're going to have to explain a few things. Pathfinder Ryder with the Andromeda Initiative. I'm from another galaxy. Take a moment. Find your bearings. More aliens? Out of nowhere? And Jal? Do none of you remember getting frozen? Frozen? I don't understand. We were just working on the monolith and then... And then you appeared. No, I you've probably been stuck for a few left. months. My mind feels a little clouded. How long have you been here? We should make sure they return to the station. Who knows what lingering effects they might suffer from. True. Make contact with the scientists and return to Kiran Dals. Okay, I'm just going to do that later on. But first we need to find that Turian encampment. So I guess I'll see you guys in a second when I find a way to get there. Dinosaurs! Okay, she actually, Vetra has a pretty cool weapon on her. Um, so that were two Velociraptors, it looked like. So let's continue on. And uh, we should be. Oh, don't want to antagonize all those animals. But I think I just did. So let's go around the monolith, and this is where we will need to go, I think. Did I scan this thing already? I did. Ooh. Take out some of the spiders. And there's more where that came from, apparently. And more nickel. Thank you very much. Jumping for joy, apparently. Kind of missed a button there. And now we should be getting close to where the Turian encampment is. Okay. Good Heads job, up. guys. And turn oh, shit. There goes one. There goes a headshot. There are snipers active as well. There we go. The saboteur, then that guy. Where is that saboteur guy? There we go, there he is. And I'm out of ammo. Oh, oh, oh. Let's get Remy back. There's a sniper guy trying to kill me. The party just got bigger. The party just got bigger? What? 
Okay, take take whatever that was. I, I didn't get anything. There we go. Sniper rifle reinforced barrel. Oh shit, they're spawning behind us. Yeah, I know there's a memory thingy, but I don't really have time for that. Petra, get over here. Changing positions. I would say let them Let's come to it. us. Thank you. Come on, poke your head up. There goes another headshot. That'll show him. And another headshot. Okay, so we defended the Tyrians from the Rokar. That's I, I was kind of confused on that account. Because it kind of looked like we were fighting both of them. When they started it. Because Sarah was kind of confused that there were uh, Turians around here. And I don't think she should have been. Because we kind of knew what we were coming here for. Um, let's check it out. Can we actually scan anything here? Doesn't seem like it for now. I do have a bit more loot. Because this is, this is piling up rather nicely. So where is this Turian guy? Hello, Turian leader. Ooh, looking awesome as ever. Oh, he's gonna get shot in the face, isn't he? There we go. Goodbye. I do love the Turians. <laughs> shot to the gut. Painful. And that one was to the head, I suppose. I appreciate the help back there. You're welcome. My name's Avidus Ricks. Sorry if my methods seem extreme. Civilian life is trying. Well, I think you Sarah pulled Ryder, your own. Pathfinder. You former military? A specter. Special tactics and reconnaissance. Did the council's dirty work for 15 years. You were the council's maid. That explains your tactics, though. So you're used to being above the law. Well, good thing there are no laws in Andromeda, huh? The initiative was my retirement plan. Then Natanis hit the scourge and bam, woke up here. What happened? Where's the Ark? No idea. Had to break out of my own damn stasis pod. A fall like that should have killed you. Now those pods are sturdier than they look. But most of the Turian population is still missing. Including Mason, our Pathfinder. Sam hasn't transferred to me, so he's alive. Just don't know where. Huh. Wish I had good news for you, indeed. He hasn't made it back to the Nexus. Knowing Mason, he's out there looking for me. Mason dedicated his life to Andromeda. He's too stubborn to die now. Yeah, but sometimes stubbornness doesn't help you that much. The pods from Atanas are scattered across the sector. Between the two of us, we should find something. Yup, sounds like a plan. You go left, I go right. <laughs> something like that. Here's my frequency. Call when you find something. Okay. So, again, on hold, keep an eye out for Ark Natanas, Survivors, or Debris. We did get a bit of uh, experience for that, but that's pretty much it. I'm just going to check around. I didn't miss anything aside, of course, from the memory trigger. There we go. So that should give us something nice Another when we return to the up. Nexus. Yes, though my memory array remains locked. Additional triggers are required. Okay, so let's open up this container. Welding electrodes should come in handy. Let's put Remy away. Goodbye, Remy. And then, anything else here? This is, looks like this keeps going. Kind of had something for a second there. Ah, there, nickel. Just a bit of nickel and a container with two more components that I can sell later on. Okay, so that's the Tyrian Ark kicked off, which is pretty good. Uh, this woman seems to need our help, or man. I'm assuming it's a woman because of the name, but... I can't believe this is really yeah. happening. Thought we'd be stuck here forever, or until the aliens killed us. We built this camp from what remained of our stasis pod. If we leave, 
We can't abandon our wreckage. There's debris we couldn't get to out there. We have to take it with us. Okay, we'll get it all. Anything from the crash belongs to the initiative. It'll go back to the Nexus with you. Good. No telling what's still intact. Don't want hostile aliens using it against us. If you find anything from Ark Natanis, tag it for recovery. Oh, and thank you. You're welcome. So tag Natanis debris for recover for removal on Havarl. Like this then. Or not. Maybe, maybe, I don't know. Okay, so that's 100 research data added again, and there's a data pad over here. New entry, there's something wrong with this planet. Plants sprout up behind you, the trees whisper, and I swear something other than those aliens is watching us. Thanks, spirits, for the spectre. If we survive, it's because of Avatus. So he is uh, an inspiring figure, clearly. Uh, ooh, there's another container over here. And garden meditation crystal. Thanks for that anyway. Might be able to uh, make some more weapons out of that. And if I can make better weapons for my crewmates, all the better. And then new entry, another attack by those things. The aliens can't go two days without an ambush. And if it's not them, it's the damn plants poisoning, and poisoning us or destroying whatever equipment we can scavenge. I keep wondering about the other arcs. Maybe they fared better than and are mounting a rescue. Just hope it's not the humans. Arrogant bastards would never let us forget it. <laughs> okay then, sorry for that one. We don't uh, really want to be all that arrogant. Anything else I need to check out? Doesn't seem like it. Okay. Um, maybe I'm going to try and find the rest of the monoliths on this planet. Because that might help us out to uh, clear out the rainstorm on this planet, I suppose then. Because the atmosphere is pretty good. I activated one monolith already. Maybe uh, another one wouldn't be so bad. So give me a second. We've scanned this area. These structures go deep below the ground. And Stay alert. We don't know what's down there. Got them all. If those floaty remnant bots try to push us off the edge, I'll be mad. So I found the bridge, which we might be able to... However, the generator that runs the bridge appears to be non-functional. We would not be able to find the parts to repair it. Huh. Okay, then that's really pessimistic. So we need to get the Angara here then, I suppose. Is there any other way we can access that? Because it looks like we should. It also looks like there's clearly something down there. Um, and then again, it doesn't look like we should, we would be able to get back up there. Automated protocols activated. Dropping down. Deploying forward station. Okay, and it seems like the remnant are fighting some uh, creatures down there. I would be glad to help out the creatures. There we go, and then let's go down. I think mostly they killed each other off, aside from a few down there maybe. But how do we move forward here? There's a lot of stuff down here, but... Don't seem to be able to get anywhere from here. Aside from maybe... Aha! Uh -huh. There are a few terminals here, so I might be able to do something with that. Arknatanis debris. Tagged for salvage. There we go. Working on our side quests. And then there's a terminal over here. That should open up... Okay. That's something at least, but I don't know. Oh shit! That was annoying. Okay, so it's a real bitch to get around. Uh, We've got targets. 
these uh, this this planet sometimes because there's a lot of enemies strewn around here. Copy copy that with uh, well, combine that with the uh, fucking wildlife that's everywhere. It's really hard to get around. I can't seem to repair the bridge on the other side of the of the chasm over there to get to the rest of the the remnant structures. So I think I'm gonna just head back to the Tempest. Uh, although I don't really know how to do that without reaching one of those forward stations. So I'm gonna place that one over there and then we'll be able to just uh, get back to the Tempest. Oh, never mind, not that one over there. Maybe that one down there because I can't cross the bridge, of course. So see you guys at the Tempest in a second. Can we talk when you're free? So back on the Tempest, Suvi apparently needs a word, so let's talk to her. The swelling has gone down significantly, and I seem to be able to talk normally again. Good. Keep me updated. And remember, cool food and liquid only. Nothing spicy. Thank you, Lexi. Okay, are you alright? Is there something wrong? Did you hurt yourself? Oh, it's nothing. I'm just getting over some inflammation of the soft tissues of the mouth. It was dramatic, but ultimately non-threatening. I... What? Have you ever heard of the Lick test? Back before scanners were portable, Earth scientists would employ this test in the field. They used it to tell rocks from fossils and get a basic idea of their mineral composition. So, technically you licked something. <laughs> you licked a rock, didn't you? <sighs> I was distracted and forgot it was a Helios rock. I do it unconsciously. When I was little, my father and I would go on expeditions. The lick test was a huge part of it. He made science fun for me. Your mother was something of a scientist, wasn't she? Yeah, she was. She specialized in biotics research. Got her start in medicine. I read all about her research and your father's. AI and implants. They achieved so much in so little time. Sam is an astounding achievement. I left my parents back home. They told me they were proud of me and then lived out their lives while I slept. Of course they were proud. If I were them, I'd be proud too. You came here for the sake of science. That takes courage. Some crazy, but mostly courage. I'm sure they knew that. <laughs> Thank you, Ryder. I needed that. Anytime. You're welcome, Sylvie. You are welcome. So let's see if any anybody else needs our uh, attention. Maybe PB? Peeves, are you in there? Holy shit. Proof of concept. Hi. Well, I call him Remy. And he's a good boy, isn't he? Yeah, where's Peeves? Who haven't we talked to recently? Maybe Drac, because Drac has been pretty silent, although Wait, there's Phoebes. Lexi, your dad was Turian? That explains so much. What's that supposed to mean? Here we go. You know, how uptight you are. I am not uptight. Not even 300 years old and fussing at us like a matriarch. I'm a doctor. Fussing's part of the job. Okay then, that was interesting. Hello, peeps. We were right about talk? the vault on Aya, huh? What a find. And this Meridian vault might jumpstart all the others. I knew hitching my wagon to yours would pay off. <laughs> flirting. It's every single time it's there, just flirting. So what's your take? Is this Meridian what we think it is? Everything we've seen, each remnant system we've uncovered, is connected to everything else. The bots, the monoliths, the vaults. It stands to reason that activating Meridian will connect the entire network and rekindle terraforming across the cluster. So you think we're doing the right thing? Well, yeah. Hopefully that doesn't, well, go wrong, because terraforming isn't something you should do nilly-willy. So let's go with flirting. I like it when you flirt. I wouldn't want you to stop. Have I flirted with you? <laughs> Don't worry, Ryder. I'm relentless. It relaxes me. Huh. Well, I'll leave you to it. Thanks for chatting. We'll talk again later. You know it. Yeah, of course we know it. Because we're going to continue this probably pretty soon. Do I get to see 
track somewhere. Oh, hello, Jal. That's also Jal. an option. Thank you for checking. But I'm all right. Because he had the cat revelation to deal with it. I have to be. How else do we go on? You know? Want to talk about it? I may seem tough, but I have a good shoulder. That's kind. You're kind. I really miss my family at times like these. Are you close to your family? Um... Not really, but... Well, in the game, that is. Because in real life, I am pretty close to my family, but... Um... Are you? You talk about family a lot. <laughs> really? I guess it's just part of our culture. Our families are large, and we share our parents with the community. We all have many mothers. Wait, how does that work? And... Are you close? Yeah, kind of. I was. Am. My mom and dad are dead. My brother's in a medically induced coma. I'm kind of an orphan at the moment. I'm sorry. Yeah, well, this random collection of Tempest oddballs can feel like family sometimes. Yeah. I never really felt I had a purpose. But here, I do. Well, I'm glad we could help. My place in the Resistance is not what I'd like. But that kid on Aya looked up to you. Sure. But you are going to do something important, Ryder. I feel it. This is where I should be. Well, uh, we're really glad you're here. Yeah, we are. That's just honest. I like having you around. Specifically you. Because of my skill and knowledge? Yeah, sure. Not really. Because you enjoy spending time with me as much as I do with you. You do? Yes. You're fascinating. And special. And strange. Oh, thanks. I and still I don't know why that's a different symbol with Jaw, because it's not the romance option. It's not something romantic. It's more like companionship. And I don't know that that will, if that will lock out any other romantic involvements you can have. So, with that done, I'm just going to take a little break. So, uh, thank you guys enormously for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, don't forget to like it right here on YouTube. And, uh, well, I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye.